What's up YouTube, Seductive Souls coming at you. A video about Samsung. I'm at work. I've been meaning to make the video and I've been forgetting, so I'm doing it on my phones. The purpose of this video, I've been trying to pre-order the Z Fold 3. I have the Samsung financing credit card and my order gets canceled every single time. So finally, after eight, nine days of going through this, I got it figured out the TD bank, which does the Samsung financing. One guy finally figured it out and helped me how to do it, told me how to do it, excuse me. So with that being said, I'm gonna get into this and show you. I'm gonna go to the Samsung, Shop Samsung app and let you see this. What doesn't make sense is I have the Samsung financing credit card with the Samsung care. As you can see, they charge my card every month twelve dollars eighty six cents but i can't make the purchase for this phone so i'm going to scroll and show you how many canceled orders i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and then the twelfth order finally went through and then, of course, they charge me again for the Samsung Finance. As you can see, all those are canceled. So what's been going on, I placed the pre-order. It goes through. They send me an order confirmation. And then one minute later, it gets canceled. So the problem is the Samsung Finance card is approving it, but Samsung is saying fraud detection. So... I'm going to show you the emails, the confirmation emails. This, this is all the, all the emails from them, from Samsung. I'll just click one. Order received for the phone. Order received for the phone. And then here's the here's the next one after that. To show that the order was canceled. We're sorry. Thank you, the dub, but we have to cancel. Be sure your billing, shipping, phone number, and everything like that is correct. And through the bank, all my information is correct. With Samsung, all my information is correct. I haven't changed anything, but I keep getting this error. Samsung advised me to call the bank, the TD Bank. They verified everything was clear that I had the money in my account. Samsung say, have you changed any of your information? No, I haven't. So Samsung don't even know how to fix this problem. They're losing customers money because they can't verify customers information. So I kept trying. They told me to try from a desktop. I tried from a desktop. I even deleted the apps logged out log in reset my phone everything like that and it's and it still didn't go through so i kept trying and finally i called the bank and one of the guys from the bank advised me to do this so the problem is they're saying fraud they can't verify your information on your web browser or desktop go to samsung.com as you can see, you got two hours and two days and 13 hours left to pre order the Z Fold 3. Go to Samsung.com, log in, and in the upper right corner, click those three dots that drop down, scroll down, and click My Account. Let that load. The next page comes up just like this. Click my account info. It'll load another page. Now I'm going to show you where the problem is. The problem is right here. Keep scrolling. You got my name, birthday. If you look right here, it says address. It just has the zip code. That's the problem why your information can't be verified because it doesn't have a valid address for you it just has the zip code so that being said click ed edit personal information 
type in your address and then click save and once you do that it'll update your information go back to the samsung shop app whatever phone you're trying to order or tv go through place everything into your cart place your order and then it'll go through everything will work fine after that i get i guarantee you this will work because it worked for me and i can show you once again Oh, through the app, I can show you once again my orders that I've I've tried. What I say, 12, 13 times. All the all these have been canceled for the Z Fold Three. I even tried the right here. I tried to order the headphones just to see, or the case just to see if it would go through, and it went through. And then a minute later, it was canceled. And there we go right here. The order the order went through. So update your address through the desktop on Samsung.com and your order will go through. And don't listen to them telling you to try a different payment method and all that kind of stuff. I got the email. I got 10, 20 emails of that. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think.